Today we're making a game, but it will also not, because this is a game where you make games and then you are part of a company and that makes games. I hope that made sense. Company name. Yes. A. There you go. My name is A. I like continue. If you ever want to review a tutorial, then go to whatever. Congratulations. Wow. That was it's probably way easier than it actually is. Start developing your first game. Develop new game. Before development, you have to choose what game and that. So we have, for some reason, we can't create any we want. And also, how can you create a game movie? Like, it's interactive game? I don't know. Interactive adventure. Yeah, that's probably good. And then we can get the Nintendo 64 or the PC. Wait, dev cost? Those are dev cost? What is this? Give me your money. All right, let's see. I accidentally took a photo. Uh, I like give me your money. Text based or two two D graphics. A text based game would be too easy. So uh, two two D graphics. Game development runs through three stages. At the beginning of each stage, you can decide the size of the game what you want to focus on. Ah uh, yes. Um. Oh no. Story and quest should be pretty big though. Let's go. We we gain the dot. The game development has not started. Well, while developing your game, you you can see stuff that adds up and. Stuff is going on. From now to time, from now to now, there will be bug points, and you're gonna have to do stuff about them. Dialogue? I don't think it needs much dialogue. Oh, but that then people will make more theories on the game. <laughs> well, should we just crank it up to the max? I mean, yeah, dialogue in a movie adventure game, that, that makes a lot of sense. I should have thought about that. During development, you can also select uh, additional features for your game. Right now, you can only pick basic sounds, but your options will increase greatly. You can uh, you will also see the graphic type you, you selected when you define the game. It's just to remind you of your short. So, world design? Eh, that should be pretty good. That. Graphics? Graphics don't need to be that good. People don't really care. How, how do we have $40,000? The, the development of the game. I don't know. I'm speaking like this. That's now finished. New topic. New combo. Yeah, yeah. What is A? That's that. Is that? I'm. Oh yeah, my name is A. Your game is now complete. Oh, like we need to see reviews. Okay, let's see. Give me your money. What do you think? Okay. Uh, I'm better than a one. Not bad. Not good. Hey, it's a movie adventure game. I bet uh, there's still probably gonna be a bunch of theories. Everybody's giving it a 5. I mean, for a game that's called Give Me Your Money, that's still pretty good. After publishing a game, you can invest a little time to analyze your creation. Game reports are a great way to gain, you, to gain research points, yada yada yada. 10 RP? What is this? Uh, ooh, martial arts. School, Noah. Nobody wanna play that. A newcomer in the gaming industry has just released their first game, Give Me Your Money. This game has a safe favor. You guys see favorable reviews, but such a good start they shot a game, gain stuff quickly. Well, why do you put a car in your room? You give me your money was so successful that we now have 20 fans. Whoa! Can you continue researching? It looks like researching is just type. Man, you need to go to sleep. You can't just sit here forever. Alright, uh, develop new game. Okay, we got a martial arts. I mean, it only makes sense for martial arts action. We can go Visky. G64. Of course, we need the 2D graphics, I mean. All right, engine, zero, there we go. Boom. We need more theories with the story. Dialogues. I love dialogues. They give me your money. Just reach 10k sale. Oh my goodness. It's still gaining units while I'm still making this game. Uh, sound? Yeah, that's... Oh, dang. I could just make no, no sound. I knew it would be good, I knew it would be successful. Give Me Your Money is the best game in history. Even though the reviewers only gave it like 5 out of 10, but... But they ain't right. There's one bug. Hopefully that won't do anything to us. Oh, let's go, good topic, good genre combination. That, I mean, martial arts combat makes sense. Okay, let's see what other reviews. <gasps> wow, what? Oh wait, I didn't even name it, it's just called Game 2. How dare you. But it was a good combination. Okay, let's research another one. Look at zombies, y'all like zombie games, right? Y'all should, should like that. Oh no, I got minus one fans. It's steadily outselling competitors in the PC section. Okay. So we're gonna have to get more Nintendo 64s. Okay, we're still making a lot of money, even, but we're losing fans. Like, one fan. We're losing one fan every single unit. Alright, y'all want a zombie game? We're gonna do a zombie 
RPG. And it's gonna obviously be on the G64, on the, I mean Nintendo 64. Alright, so the engine's gonna actually have to be good, because I think people like engine. Dude, I didn't name it yet, no, it's just gonna be called Game 3. Can I rename it Game- Can I rename it from Game 3? No. Dialogue, there's not gonna be much dialogue. Uh, maybe I'll like a dialogue-less game. Oh my, oh my gosh, the Japanese com company Nintendo. <laughs> oh wow, Nintendo. Is, is planning to release its very own home gaming console, though named for the widely successful arcade game Dinky King. <laughs> wow, that's how to avoid copyright. Many industry people doubt, doubt home gaming consoles will take off. We are eager to see what Ninvento will deliver. Well, it did take off. Can I fix the bug? There you go, fix, there you go. Maybe that one bug ruined our entire game. Wait, let me... Let's go, I can rename it. The worst game ever. And will anyone buy the worst game ever? Ooh, I'm anticipating the reviews. Okay, I mean, that's fine. They shouldn't forget about dialogue. Uninspiring, it's a zombie game. How could you not like the zombie game? It isn't the worst game ever. It was better than game number two. Which I don't know what I would have named it, but you know. I'm becoming known for making mediocre games. Contracts have now been unlocked. I I've just finished the worst game ever, <laughs> and I think you have potential. I'm in the contracting business, and we could use skills like yours. If you're ever short on cash, let let me know. Okay. Find contract work. Just to earn some extra cash. You should take this one. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Finish it! Finish it! An inventor has confirmed recent movers about a TES, T E S, N E S, whatever. Did I do it? Yeah, contract successful. What you what what you got? Contract was successful. Excellent work. You should have contracts every six months. Wow. Okay. Oh, let's go. The worst game ever is doing so good. I mean, Wii Sports. I mean, we Wii, Wii Sports really took off. Strategy sports game. I mean, that that would probably work. Although, we might be spending a lot of money here, but it's for good causes, I I think. No, I forgot to name it again, no. It's just gonna be a whole lot of gameplay. And I hope that people like the dialogue. So, the, this course is gonna need... We're gonna obviously need some dialogue. Because they said... Oh, don't forget about the dialogue. The artificial intelligence is gonna be really big. Uh, the dialogue could maybe be like... Oh, welcome to the tennis area. In this uh, game, you will play tennis... And you will hit it with your Wii remote and break your TV. Oh my gosh, it's getting so much bugs. Fix the bugs. No. Fix the bugs. There you go. Alright, please do good. If this doesn't do good, then this is gonna be bad. Oh, I, d I forgot to name it. Has its moments? Oh, okay. N never mind. They shouldn't forget about story and uh, flash quest. I... I have to, I, I, I in our game four, which I was gonna, which I was gonna name Wii Sports, but was not gonna be found. I would have been the person to invent Wii Sports. I can invent Duck Hunt. Yes, I can invent Duck Hunt. Hope Ninvento isn't too mad at me. Okay, so, story quest. You said I obviously shouldn't forget about this, so let's make that most of the game. Now the graphics need to be really good here. Sound. Everything is just gonna be. Everything's gonna be a- there's gonna be a bit more world design than everything else. Okay, I hope this is good. Oh, new record? Is that good? Level design? Artificial intelligence? Can I be the person to invent Duck Hunt? Alright. At least give us a 6 out of 10. Let's go! Hunting and action is a great combination! Finally! Let's go! I finally made my first good game! 8 out of 10! Yeah! Oh yes, beautiful, and it's and only a 7 out of 10. Oh, this is making us some money! Oh, money, money! Oh, oh. 